the Lord will fill you up until you overflow. I want to speak to men and women of God, children of God, that have found themselves in this kind of dry land, in a place where in your spiritual life, specifically, there has been some kind of dryness. And the Lord wants to um, fill you with his power. And for some of you, you actually desire the gift of praying in the spirit and the Lord wants to fill you until you until you overflow a child of God the Lord wants to bring about an overflow of living water in your life the Lord said said in his voice is out of your belly will flow rivers of living water hallelujah but the Lord is saying we need to remain in connection with him and you know what Ephesians 3 20 says that he's he's the one that's able to do exceedingly and abundantly far beyond what we can you know think hallelujah far beyond what we can ask the Lord to do according to the power that works in us and that power that works in us that we don't or that we are not even aware of is the power of Jesus it is the power of his Holy Spirit and that power resides within us Hallelujah. That is the power that causes that living water to be stirred up on the inside of us and push away every dryness and turn every wasteland around and, 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 and shift the dryness and, and shift everything that doesn't look fruitful in our lives and turn it. Hallelujah. The Lord wants to make a way for you in your spiritual life. The Lord wants that fire to be burning again. The Lord wants you to overflow with his power and with his presence and with his love. So child of God, be encouraged. Do not be discouraged. God wants you to experience an overflow of his blessings spiritually and physically in every area of your life and also financially as well. So be encouraged and I pray this word blesses you in Jesus' mighty name. Let's pray. Oh Lord, my God, I bless your name. I give you praise, glory, and honor. I pray this word, Father God, blesses the heart of whom it, it, it is for. And I pray, Lord God, that this child of God listening right now, that they will come to see this word manifest in their lives, that you will turn around every dry land and every wasteland, oh Lord, and that you will cause streams to flow again in the desert, Heavenly Father. Wherever they're experiencing dryness in their spiritual life, in their physical life, in their marital life, in their financial life, whatever it is, Heavenly Father, let it be an overflow of your spirit, oh Lord. Let it be living water, oh Lord, flowing once again in their lives, Heavenly Father, oh God. Let it be changes, Heavenly Father, oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth make a way for these ones Heavenly Father oh Lord and the ones who are struggling Heavenly Father even in their prayer lives Heavenly Father where it's dry oh God but I pray Lord God that you would make a way oh God that you will make a way oh Lord and pour your living water on the altar of their prayer Heavenly Father that there will be a flow of the spirit that when it's time to pray they pray heavenly father and that on that same altar your fire will be born in heavenly father in the name of jesus christ of nazareth we bless your name heavenly father I receive grace i pray for you to receive grace right now child of god i impart grace upon you child of god to um, maintain a prayerful life and I, and I and i impart grace upon you as well that that she will continue to be patient and I wait upon the Lord and I seek Him and trust in Him to bring about an, an, an overflow of, of living water. And you come to see His power manifest in your life, in every area of your life, in Jesus' mighty name. The Lord will fill you. He will fill you. He will fill you. He will fill you in ways that you can ever imagine. In ways that you can never imagine, the Lord will fill you until you begin to overflow. So be encouraged. Hallelujah. In Jesus' mighty name, God bless you all.